What's up, guys? We got a lot of key fobs to review, so let's get started. We got two Acura keys here. We have an early 2000s Acura sedan key, lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. And we have the ignition key. And here we have a 2020 Acura RDX key, lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. And that is it for Acura. Here we got all my Honda keys. We have a 2010 Honda, Honda CRV key fob. Lock, unlock, and panic. Here we have a 2013 Honda Civic key fob. Lock, unlock, and trunk release, and panic. Here we have a 2013 Honda Accord key fob. Lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. Have another 2010, but a 2010 Honda Pilot key fob. Lock, unlock, and trunk release, or sorry, and panic. We have a 2015 Honda Civic. Lock, unlock, trunk release, and Remote start and panic. We have here a 2023 Honda Civic key fob. Lock, lock unlock, trunk release, remote start, and panic. We have another 2010 Honda Pilot key fob. Lock, unlock, and panic. We have a 2014 Honda CRV key. Lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. And here we have a 2014 Honda Accord key fob. Lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. And that is it for Honda, guys. Here we got Nissan. We have a 2010 Nissan Altima, sorry, Nissan Sentra key fob. Lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. Here we have a 2015 Nissan Murano key fob. Remote start, lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. Here we have a 2010 Nissan Altima key fob. Lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. And that is it for Nissan. Here we have my Hyundai keys. And here we have a 2013 Hyundai Accent key. Lock, unlock, and panic. And here is the ignition key. This one's the older key, so the symbol's actually on the side. I thought that was actually pretty cool. And here we have a 2020 Hyundai Santa Fe. Lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. And we have the flip key. And that is it for Hyundai. Here we have my Chevy keys. We'll start with this one. This one is a 2010 Chevrolet Traverse. Remote start, lock, Unlock and panic. Here we have a 2020s, maybe 2000, late 2010s Chevy key fob. Unlock, lock, and panic. Here we have a 2016 Chevrolet Colorado key fob. Lock, unlock, panic, and here is the ignition key. Here we have a 2015 Chevrolet Malibu, lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. Here's the ignition key. 
And last but not least here, we have a 2016 Chevrolet Silverado key fob. Lock, unlock, panic. And here is the ignition key. And that is it for Chevy, guys. Here we have my Chevy keys. Here we have a 2023 Jeep Wrangler key fob. Unlock, lock, and panic. Here we have a 2016 Jeep Compass key fob. Unlock, lock, and panic. And that is it for Jeep, guys. Here we have my Ford keys. Here we have a 2013 Ford Focus sedan. And this one has two keys. Unlock, lock, panic, and trunk release. And then same for this one. And here we have a 2015 Ford Ex Escape. Unlock, lock, panic, and trunk release. Here we have a 1999 Ford Focus Wagon. Unlock, lock, and trunk release. And that is it for Ford, guys. Here we have my Audi keys. Here we have a 2020 Audi R8 key. Lock, trunk release, and unlock. And there is no panic key on this one. Here we have a 2015 Audi R8. Unlock, lock, trunk release, and panic. And that is all for Audi. Unfortunately, this is my only Dodge key. But here we have a 2020 Dodge Caravan, Grand Caravan key, panic, Unlock, lock, remote start, trunk release, left door, and right door. And that is it for Dodge. Here we have a Land Rover. Here we have a 2019 Range Rover key fob. Unlock, lock, I don't really know what this button right here is, but trunk release and panic. And that is it for Land Rover. Here we have Volkswagen. Here we have a 2020 Volkswagen Jetta key fob. Lock, trunk release, and unlock, and panic. Here actually was my very first Volkswagen key fob I ordered. But lock, trunk release, unlock, and panic. And the key plate is Keyblade's just gone. And that is it for Volkswagen, everyone. This is the only Kia key I have. So here we have a 2020, sorry, 2012 Kia Soul key. Lock, trunk release, and unlock. And there is no panic on this one. And that is it for Kia, everyone. I will get more Lexus keys at some point. But for right now, this is my only Lexus key. This is a 2020 Lexus RX 450H key. Lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. And that is it for Lexus. Here we have a 2012 Mercedes CLK key fob. Panic. Um, sorry, lock, unlock, and trunk release. And that is it for Mercedes. Here we have all my Toyota keys. Here we have a 2008 Toyota Sienna key. And here we have an early 2000s Toyota truck key. I actually thought this was a valet key before I took a closer look at it, and it's not gray. So it's a regular key. And then last but not least, we have here a 2015 Toyota Sienna key. Lock, unlock, right door, left door, truck release, and panic. And that is it for Toyota, everyone. Here's my only Volvo key. This goes to a 1997 Volvo X7. The key fob's just gone, but other than that, we just have the key. And that's all for Volvo.